everyone. I am your host in the Cheetos Cup series. Welcome. We're welcoming you back. This is me. Um, if you are one of those Cheetos Cup series fans, you know that uh, it's about to be pretty exciting. Probably some random action. So, yeah. Getting straight to it. I think uh, it's going to be pretty good. We got seven laps. Uh, no fuel in or anything is going to be required during cautions. So nothing like that. Look at that. That's a good view. All right. Uh, let's get to your starting lineups. Here we go. We got Ryan Blaney on pole. With Alex Bowman right beside. So first and second, Blaney and Bowman. Third and fourth is going to be Denny Hamlin. That's Gabriel. Then you got JJ Sows and Kyle Larson and Mark Three. Row four is going to be NASCAR Nick Entertainment. Green flags in the air. Lap one. Alex Bowman takes the lead away from Ryan Blaney immediately on the start. Three wide. Gabriel's going to take it. On to lap two. They make contact. A little bit. Oh, they're wrecking. That's Kernig Entertainment and Danny Hamlin. Caution has come out. We're going to get a restart as the pack flies by them. I'm surprised they didn't throw a caution way quicker. What happened here? Okay. Oh, yeah. No, it got tied off the corner. JJ Sows into NASCAR Entertainment, which was uh, last race's winner. I think you guys know there's only seven cars. But uh, the rest of the people that aren't in here still have their points. They will, like, finish, like, if they're behind them. The only reason there's seven cars is because my mom didn't allow me to bring any more than that, so. Actually, no, I actually brought, like, five. I brought five. She only allowed me to bring five. But I got two more, so now there's seven. So, yeah. I didn't get to bring the rest, sadly. So that's why there's seven cars. But, uh... See here, JJ Sows gets into NASCAR Nick Entertainment. Almost going to his teammate, Kyle Larson. And uh, there he goes. Well, into the Denny Hamlin. And around they go. Cautions out. Green flag on the restart. Alex Bowman to lead coming to lap number five. Oh my huge wreck. Oh, the 12 is upside down. Red flag is out immediately. As the pack comes to a stop on the front straightaway, right in front of Ryan Blaney and Gabriel, who have been involved in a bad crash. The 12 of Ryan Blaney, the pole sitter, is upside down. Off turn number four here at Dover. What happened here? I mean, everything looks fine, you know. Here we go. It's off the corner. Blows the left rear tire. Actually, there's contact right there. And there. So. Then he spins out. Front of the pack. Oh, my gosh. It's 22 is sideways. He's involved in that wreck as well. But, uh, yeah, we'll be back. Red flag's been lifted. Red flag has, yep, yeah. Red flag's been lifted, but... Yellow flag's still out. Well, and we're gonna watch a few replays of what happened here. So, as we saw, it looks like someone... Oops, sorry. Someone made contact with Gabriel, causing him to spin out, and something happened to Blaney. Blaney just climbed up on top of Gabriel's left rear. 
Kyle Larson, look at the avoidance. Does he make contact? No, he doesn't. Neither does Nick. How about Denny Hamlin? Does he make contact? No, he doesn't. He makes it through clean, but we see he could have got hit by JJ there. Okay, so so JJ sent Blaney on top. Blaney hit the left rear the right left front of Gabriel sends him in the air. Logano hits him, sending him into the air even more, causing him to flip over and upside down on the front straightaway. We're gonna go overtime at Dover. Coming to the green flag once again. Green flag, we're overtime at Dover. NASCAR Entertainment leads, he blocks Jenny Hamlin, comes to the white flag, one to go. And Bowman's in the wall, still green, and NASCAR Negative Entertainment wins it. And there's a hard crash in the back. NASCAR Negative Entertainment is your winner here at Dover. And uh, we're gonna we're gonna watch. Wow. Look at this restart. See Hamlin. Ooh, Hamlin was really pressuring Nick there. Hamlin was pressuring pressuring Nick seriously. And look at that block. That was a good block. Wow. Can't believe he made that block. He pulled that block off into the corner. What happened to... Oh. So, pretty much what happened here is that Larson hit the back of the 88 of Alex Bowman, sending him into the wall. Look at the contact that's made there. That also sends Larson up the track, as you see. And Bowman's in the wall, comes back up, and uh, there, there's three wide, and that sends Nick pulling away from the field, causing him to win. What happened to um, Gabriel over there? And how about a last lap pass for third? J.J. Sows is going to be on the podium for passing Denny Hamlin. How about that? Okay, so... Uh, he might have got contact from Bowman there. He definitely got contact from Bowman. Sending him around and they crashed hard into the wall. Hold up. Yep. Yep, that is so. Let's look at Alex Bowman's onboard camera and see that's what happened. Yep, got straight into the left rear, spinning, and into the wall hard. NASCAR Negative Entertainment, I think it's his third career win. Maybe it's fourth. But that is great. We'll see you guys right after NASCAR Negative Entertainment is your winner.